Greetings everyone, this is Anthony Tech Kent, aka the Binary Options Ninja, um, and team member of the Options Power Team, one of the most prolific Binary Options team in the world. Listen, I was presented today with a question, and I thought about putting together this uh, video, this brief tutorial on, on in relation to this question. And the question was uh, centered around setting alerts for um, on net data for the relative strength index or ISI, RSI uh, indicator. Um, unfortunately, you can't set up uh, alerts on uh, chart studies, but you can set them up on the uh, actual uh, monitoring activity of the uh, candles um, but you can set up the studies to kind of help solidify your position um, that you set an alert for on your chart and the way you go about doing that for RSI is <clears throat> you have to set up the study for that particular chart and to go about doing it you can do in the shortcut method which I'm going to show you right now and on on this particular chart which is for silver and the way you go about doing that is just simply right click on the chart anywhere on the chart and you scroll down to studies and then you type in RSI in the search field and we're going to use the stochastic RSI because it's giving you a little bit more uh, granular information as opposed to the standard standard RSI, the standard RSI is just going to give you um, the period, but the stochastic is going to give you both the period and the EMA period, and you can color code it to kind of help uh, give you an, a quick heads up glance as to what you're looking at. So I'm gonna, instead of using the red and blue, I'm going to change the uh, percent K to like a green and then simply click on OK and then add and just to kind of give you an a overview of what it looks like okay that's what I want and I simply click on OK from here <clears throat> what you're looking at is on the K index uh, axis you're getting uh, the, the high and you're getting on the blue which is the uh, D which is relative to the uh, performance of your, your candles that are being presented here. And it's giving you the low. So the way I look at this is when the RSI indicates any percentage beneath 35%, it tells us that the current price on the asset is too, too low and that a trend correction is expected, which in this case it's over, oversold. And so, therefore, the correction is going to be the trending up, which you will see here from here on up. The price goes up. When it's <clears throat> another way of looking at this conversely is if it begins to trend above 65%, the current price of the current price, the asset is too high or over bought and thus a reversal to the trend is going to be expected which will show that it's going or trending down and you can also see that in your candles where it's going down the price of the uh, asset is going down so at a glance you can say okay it's going up it's over bought or oversold and when it gets up to like 65% or, or more Hey, it's time to sell because it's over overbought at that point. It'll start to trend down. When it trends down below 35%, it means that it's oversold, and then the reversal, you can expect a reversal to occur. So I hope that was able to uh, provide some level of uh, reassurance as to how to set up the RSI and to also set up the alerts. Now, the way you would 
course set up the alerts on this is simply right click at where you want to or anticipate the next uh, change to occur in the price right click then you set your alert and then at that point you can set if you've already established your contact list you can set um, uh, a message to say either put or call you save it once it reaches that um, that condition in this case a uh, bid of greater than seventeen dollars then it'll send you that notification to either your in my case to my uh, pushover API address my device my uh, Samsung device my iPad and also will show up on the screen and click save and it'll say that that alert level indicated here in the purple and when it triggers that you get a notification and at that point in time based on your assessment or your analysis here you then put put in your put or call I hope that was very helpful if you have any other questions feel free to hit me up on uh, Facebook you can reach me at uh, facebook.com forward slash binary options ninja or you can catch me on Google Plus at googleplus.com and look for binary binary options ninja or binary ninja till next time i bid you a peace and salute this is your man anthony tech kent where i put the t in tech peace out